Before we start, I know some of you are writing a blog about a specific relationship. As for I, I am going to be doing something different. I'll be talking about why I remain single. I could sit here and talk about my numerous flaws, but I have two things that are stopping me from gaining a relationship in the first place. Well, I'm just tired and afraid. I tried getting into the dating scene once and it did not bode well for me. The longer I kept myself in there, the more my mental health deteriorated. And earlier this year, I hit my lowest point. So I decided to stop and focus on myself and use that energy towards more productive things. I hunkered down on my desk and played Destiny 2 with my best friend. I know what you're thinking. Playing a game is not productive. However, after three multiple sessions with him, I began to feel better. I completed many missions and have collected items many do not have. I am proud to say that I have put down around 1000 hours into my favorite game, which many of those hours are with my best friend. This has strengthened my friendship with my best friend and I, and I have also found new friends through this game. In addition, I began to focus my energy to another thing I am passionate about, cars. During this time period, COVID was at one of its highs, so I could not just go, go to a car meet where there is a high concentration of people. The next best thing I could find was in a game called Forza Horizon 4. I began to use that game as a creative output. I began doing virtual photography and expressing my tastes with cars I fell in love with, and cars that have caught my eye. You can find these pictures on my Instagram account, links are in the description below. I'm not just tired, I am also scared. I'm afraid of what happens when I do get into a relationship. As stated before, I am very passionate with cars. Cars to me are not just a mode of transportation. They are a tool of self-expression and a signifier of one's individuality. My dream car is not the most flamboyant car you can get in the market. I dream to get a measly 1989 Nissan Skyline GTSD BNR32. I am scared that any of the relationships I may get into may hinder my dream car my dream to get this car. Also, if I do get this car, I'm scared that my significant other will use this car and my current car as a way to hurt me. I've seen numerous stories, mainly from men, that their significant others have forced them to sell their car they love in order to, in order to buy a car that has more utility. If I was put into the car's franchise, this car or my current car would be would have been used as my model. A threat to any of the cars I love is a threat to me as an, an individual. I haven't given up in relationships, however. I believe that one day I'll meet that one person. For the time being, I'll enjoy my single life.